today we're going to be sharing the full Fright Fest 2022 lineup for Six Flags Magic Mountain. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am the C-H-A-L-L, Doncaster born but built for theme parks and your theme park journalist and welcome to a Halloween update bringing you spectacular news from the world of theme parks and attractions. Today, we're going to be sharing the full Fright Fest 2022 lineup for Six Flags Magic Mountain. So before we get started, make sure you do like, comment, subscribe, cut the notification bell to never shoot your video and for now... Let's have a look at the full lineup for Fright Fest 2022 over at Magic Mountain. Through Screamscape, the Fright Fest lineup at Six Flags Magic Mountain has been officially announced, with the event set to take place on 23 select nights from September 10th through to October 31st, 2022. This year's event will feature a brand new haunted house, two new scare zones, a new show, and a new haunted happy hour. Now, in terms of the houses, and the scare zones just to give you a little bit of an idea as to what is happening during the event so we're going to go through these one by one so first of all truth or dare the brand new one for 2022 in a warped game of truth or dare the unknown lurking in every corner will leave you questioning your every move now this will be located near the full throttle roller coaster which opened at the park back in 2013 Next up, Devil's Triangle, step into the darkest caves of the deep blue sea when the souls of many have been lost and lurk in the shadows of the Devil's Triangle. This will be located over at the main gate plaza of the theme park. Carniv Hell, step right up and enter if you dare into this once thriving circus taken over by a carnivorous band of carnies that show no mercy to wandering patrons. This is going to be located in the Bugs Bunny World area of the park. Now, Willoughby's Resurrected, the Willoughby's family mansion tale unfolds before your eyes at this once affluent Victorian mansion that has become a haven to evil spirits. This will be located near the Ninja Roller Coaster. We next have Condemned, Forever Damned. Beware the souls of those who lived in this dilapidated home. Now, this will also be located near Full Throttle. Vault 666 Unlocked. Demonic relics and obsolete uh, oddities are locked in an abandoned vault in this dark and sinister antique shop. This will also be located near Full Throttle, so you've got quite a few stuff located near Full Throttle. Sewer of Souls. Vanish into the underground world of lost souls and terrifying tunnels where evil oozes and creatures torn. This scare attraction will be located near Ninja as well. Aftermath 2, Chaos Rising, the city of Ash Valley is threatened by the release of a deadly poison. This will be near Apocalypse, the wooden coaster. The Rising, set on the remains of a sunken pirate ship, witness the battle of good versus the powerful and demonic Devil's Claw. This will be located in the Devil's Triangle, so that will be located in that area of the park. We do have scare zones as well, the Dead Zone, Terrorizing, Dark Developments, City Under Siege, Territory, Twisted, Nightmares, a twist of fantasy, Exile Hill. Spirits with Spirits is an evening of monster maimment featuring music, spirits of both natures, and a buffet of treats to die for. And this will be located on the West Picnic Pavilion with an additional fee required for this one. So that is the full Fright Night lineup. And I will share my thoughts, well, Fright Fest, whatever you like, Fright Night, Fright Fest, it is Fright Fest. And I will share my thoughts on this confirmed lineup so there we are ladies and gentlemen that is the full lineup for the six fives magic mountain fright fest 2022 some new stuff to look forward to i'm very excited to hear when i hear about truth or dare it sounds like a very confused very eerie looking maze really looking forward to that one and uh you know it's very interesting to see what happens with that one um i think vault triple six unlocked definitely sounds amazing uh the rising sounds quite scary uh, I think all of them just stand out for very different reasons for me. I think the the entertainment that's going to be on offering as well sounds nice. Uh, the scare zones, definitely a real range of scare zones and themes of scare zones as well. So I think Magic Mountain's definitely doing a wonderful job with this one. And, and um, you know, Magic Mountain are definitely going to keep up in their game, keep rising their game. And uh, it's going to be very, very interesting to see what happens. I really am looking forward to this. I really, really am. So uh, I'm personally really looking forward to this. I hope you guys that are going out to the event are really excited about this as well. I don't think I can travel out there this year. I'm really sorry about that, but 
the aim is to try and get out to as many Halloween events as possible over the next few years. So I will at some point hopefully try and get out to Fright Fest at some of these Six Flags parks and try them out and review them. So that is it for this video, guys. Make sure you do like, comment, subscribe. And for now, I am Coaster Chow, Donkster Born, but built for theme parks. And your theme park journalist, keep living the coaster life. I'll see you guys next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a fright-tastic day. Ooh.